Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to use CodePen in 2023. So if you're interested, let's start our tutorial. So in this case, we'll be using CodePen. So what is CodePen? So CodePen is a tool or platform wherein you'll be able to immediately start coding or creating your HTML, CSS, and even JS scripts for your project. Now, CodePen, you can actually access this online and even code without installing any softwares into your PC. Now, in this case, the first thing that we want to do here is we need to go to CodePen.io and from here, click on the Start Coding option. Now, from here, immediately, we'll be able to see four sections. Now, we have our HTML here, our CSS and JS and the overall look of our web page here. Now, in this case, you could go ahead and just add your HTML here, which is the skeleton of our website. CSS is going to be the design for our website here. And JS is going to be our brain for the website. Now, in the top right of your screen, you could go ahead and click on settings. Now, in settings, you can change a few things for your project here. Now, for HTML, you could change the preprocessor the add classes to HTML and stuff for head if you have those. Now we also have the updates or the settings for CSS, which includes the preprocessor, CSS base, vendor prefixing, and the add external style sheets or pens. Now for JS, we have JavaScript preprocessor, the add external script pens, which includes jQuery, load dash, react, angular, view, and a lot more. Now we also have the packages option. Now here we also have the pen details or our project details. The privacy if you want to keep this a secret but you need to have the pro for you to utilize this specific feature. Now we also have the behavior here which includes auto save, auto updating preview and format on save. Like for example you don't want to lose progress on your project or your pen here you might want to consider making sure that the auto save function is actually turned on. Now here we have the editor, the template and the screenshot option as well. Now from here what you need to do if you want to save your project here or your pen here just click on the save at the top right here and you'll be able to save it. Now in this case, for you to save your project or your pen here, you need to sign up to their platform. Now in this case, signing up to their platform is pretty easy. Just provide your username and your password and a few other details about yourself to complete the whole sign up process. Now in this case, just to give you an idea, I'm going to go ahead and enter some tags here as well as some portions of CSS. So in this case, maybe we want to add a div here just to give you an example. So let's just close this tag here. And from here, we want to add a basic CSS. So maybe we want to have a red background for that specific div. As you can see, we can see the changes real time at the bottom section here. Also, you can change the current view of your UI here. As you can see, I'm able to make the Previous screen, a lot bigger or a lot smaller depending on what you need. But yeah, so using CodePen is actually pretty easy. So if you need to co code on the go, CodePen is your best friend. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you. Like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.